I've recently just developed a pricing model for my product and I got to develop a pricing page. What if I told you, you could do that in like five minutes? The best part is we're not even going to be writing that much code, so let's hop straight into it. First, we're going to want to go to this website right here. The link will be in the description, but essentially we designed the whole page here and we just copy and paste the code into our pro uh, project and it'll work. So let's do it. Let me have, I've written down all the pricing stuff here, so I'm just going to go off of what I have. All right, now we got a pricing page and I tried to get the color scheme as close as I could to my theme and my website. Uh, it's looking good. So as you can see, it's not the conventional monthly payments or anything like that. It's a coin based system, but this is what I've got. It's pretty, very simple, extremely simple actually. Um, and yeah, all we have to do now is copy code and include these files into our project. Very simple. So let's do that now. Okay, as you can see, after fixing some of the errors, we have our pricing page. It's not exactly dark mode, so we're going to go in and fix that. And also, there's still these little check marks that I want to remove. So I'm going to go in and do that manually in the code, and we're going to see what it looks like after that. All right, and we're back, and now we have our simple pricing cards. They're very, very simple. This is obviously just a base. You're supposed to build on top of this. You know, there's like a little green effect. I didn't even notice that. But yeah, very simple. Let me, I'm going to honestly take that off. It looks bad. But yeah, like I said, this is just a base. Uh, this is where we get started. And it doesn't look bad. It looks pretty good. And we saved a lot of time by doing it. Yeah. 